recording, okay? Okay, now read it from here, number one. Yes, sir. Recent advances in technology have made it possible for students to learn at home using devices like laptops, tablets, and smartphones. Instead of going to school or university every day, it would be wise to consider carefully the advantages of both types of learning. One advantage of online learning is that students can study in a place that is convenient for them. This might be at the kitchen table or in the living room or for the lucky ones, their own room or study. Students can work at a time that suits them and are not confined to to the set times of the school days. This is useful for students who work better in the early evening or late at night. Travel time is eliminated too. Walking, taking public transport, or being driven to school takes time, which can be used by students for pastimes or hobbies instead. Students really ought to be encouraged to unwind after their studies, and they can do this by playing sports, for example, or even by going to bed early to be mm. fresh, fresh for the next day's learning. Okay. Students can learn at their own pace as they progress through online work. There is no need to stop work because a bell has rung, and there is no pressure to keep up with others. The removal of time constraints constraint is beneficial for many students who then have the chance to revisit a later point aspect of learning which which they have not completely understood. Mm. With online learning, they can do this as often as they like and in their own time. Okay. Online learning provides opportunities for individual feedbacks at, the, at a time which is mutually suitable for both student and teacher, as this feedback can be tailored to the need of the individual student. Good teachers always give feedbacks and opportunities for students to ask questions in a classroom setting. But large classes can sometimes make this difficult. Students who are shy about out in class might feel empowered to engage in dialogue with their teacher in a more private setting online. Furthermore, in science for intense, more experiments considered too dangerous for a school laboratory, such as those involving noxious fumes and dangerous elements like phosphorus or mercury, can be demonstrated more safely online. This shows a broader range of learning content which is available in the online classroom. Good, good. Mm -hmm. Classroom learning also has many advantages because teachers are physically present, they can identify immediately and any problems students are facing. Classroom students can work more easily in groups so that they help each other in their learning. This ability to cooperate with others is a life skill that will have a beneficial impact on others as of the student's life, for example, in personal relationships and later in the world of work. Teachers should never underestimate the advantages of group work. Mm -hmm. Valuable feedback from other students and not just the teacher is easier to achieve in a classroom setting and this feedback from someone their own age may have greater impact. Good. Mm -hmm. Classroom learning provides an important opportunity for students to socialize while during breaks or on the journey to and from school. No one can survive without friends and there are many in intenses of long of lifelong friendships being formed in school. School also offers chances of extra 
extracurricular activities ranging from drama groups and debating societies to various sports clubs, all of which enhance the overall experience of school life. The classroom environment comes with its own rules which are separate from those of the home and obeying school rules encourages personal discipline which builds character and in and is useful in later life. Mm. After all, when they leave school, students will continue to encounter rules throughout their lives. Moreover, classroom students access to facilities which cannot be provided online, such as gyms and dance or yoga studios. And of course, the joy of real books in a school library. The learning environment of the classroom is generally more educationally stimulating than the kitchen, living room, or study at home. With things like wall displays of students' work or and study-related pictures and photographs. Beautiful reading, okay. Uh, it's a very nice, and uh, there are some question answers so we'll do about it tomorrow. Okay. Okay. And uh, inshallah, we'll continue. Uh, today is good enough for this class, and uh, okay. you, you should see your the uh, corrections that I've made. Okay. Next time when you're writing, okay, keep the point in mind. Okay. Okay. Sir. Okay. Till tomorrow, no homework. Okay. I'll meet you in the next class okay. Monday, maybe on Monday, Monday or Tuesday. I think that will be her mail. Uh, uh, we'll on Thursday. Like on next Thursday or Friday? Thursday or Friday. We'll meet again. Okay, till then. Okay. Stay blessed. Okay, goodbye. Good night. Good night.